What's up, everybody? It's Mags, and there is big stuff coming to season one of uh, Black Ops 6. So I'm going to run through it, show you everything that's coming, and yeah. So originally, this is supposed to come out November 14th, but it's been pushed back to the 21st, so ignore the November 14th part. But uh, we got a lot of stuff coming. This is the roadmap for the season. And I might go through them like one by one, you know, talk about them, get my opinions, whatever. There is a few maps coming along with the return of Hacienda. All the updates I'm going to be talking about is coming from Charlie Intel. So we're going to take a look at this map video. So we see the new maps coming in this season. And then we could start talking about all the other like weapons and camos and um, perks and stuff that's going to be added. So let's take a look at this real quick. So one of the maps are adding to it is um, extraction. It's like a uh, air airport kind of beat at the beach. You know what I'm saying? There's like a lobby area, you know, helipad, all that cool stuff. Then we got heirloom. It looks more like a museum and it's going to be a 2v2 and 6v6 map. So, yeah. Then we got racket, another 2v2, 6v6 map. It's like a bank looking type of beat. Another map is hideout. It's like a looks like a just like a military CAA kind of hideout. You know, got the shipping containers, the, like the offices, stuff like that. And then there's gonna be the return of High Sienda. So the zombies map for this season, it looks like a looks like a castle kind of like a rundown castle. I see some technology here, but that's what it's looking like a rundown castle. So I'm excited for that. I've been on the zombies grind a little bit, trying to get camos, so that should be cool. Another thing coming is rank play. These are going to be the rank play skins. So you get your, your standard skin all the way to the iridescent. Then we got the top 250 skin and then the champion. The champion looks pretty cool. I've never been a big fan of the ranked skins. I think they're kind of like, eh. For like you're playing to grind this much, you should get like some decent skins. I think these are pretty basic in my opinion. The champion one is dope just because of the skull, but like... Everything else is kind of like, eh, whatever. We got some skins dropping with season one. Something about Treyarch always hits, bro. Like, look at these. Look at these. This one's like, I mean, whatever. But like, that's dope. That's pretty cool. Some like steampunk type of beat. Then we have Prop Hunt. Prop Hunt's coming back, okay? So, anybody that likes Prop Hunt, I never really got into Prop Hunt because I usually played. COD kind of like solo dolo, you know, multiplayer type of stuff. But anybody that's look looking forward to some prop hunt, there you go. You're getting prop hunt back. All right. All right. Weapons. Okay. We got a, we got a bunch of weapons coming. So the one's not shown in this picture. There's a drill that's going to be in a cleaver. These are two melee weapons. All right. Then we got the Krig coming back. Nice AR. Everybody loves the Krig. Okay. Then we got SOG. I don't think that's in this picture. Maelstrom. I, it's like a semi-auto, full-auto shotgun type of beat. Then we got the freaking AMR Mod 4. That is a Barrett 50 cal. So Barrett 50 cals are either really good in games or really bad. So we're going to see if this is a good one or if this is a bad one. I'm hoping it's a good one because the sniping in this game, I'm not the biggest fan. I don't know if it's the centering. I don't know if it, what it is. It's just a little bit off to me. Maybe I just suck. I don't, I don't know, buddy. Then we got the uh, Siren 9mm. All right. Looks like a kind of like a, uh, like kind of look, looks like a Mac 11 type of beat. I, I don't even know. I'm saying type of beat too much, but yeah. But that's pretty much the roadmap. We got Battle Pass coming. There's going to be a new event, Hit List. You know, we got 
uh, new gobble gums coming. There's gonna be a new score streak, the hand cannon. So the hand cannon was in Black Ops 4. It's like a one shot kill type of thing. New perk, the shadow perk makes it so that you don't trigger mines and like traps that are on the ground or stuff. So there's that. Then we got Warzone dropping. So with Warzone, we got new mastery camos, okay? We got, I don't know what the name of this camo is. Okay, here we go, here we go. Golden Tiger, King's Ransom, Catalyst, and Abyss. So this isn't all the pictures of them, but here's one skin. Then we got, the new map's gonna be Area 99. So we have, this is the new map. I think a few of the old maps are still gonna be in, but this is gonna be the newest one. What else we got? There's gonna be a new way to make class, it's a new class system. So there's here are all the perks, you know, scavenger, all that good stuff. And you're gonna have wild cards as well. So they're gonna do a multiplayer multiplayer style loadout type of thing, but you just use it in Warzone. But here's a picture of the drill, the map, the SOG. We also have new modes coming, okay? There's gonna be plunder, battle royale, and resurgence. So we all know battle, battle royale, resurgence, all that good shit. Rank play. But yeah. We got a few bundles coming and with all that, we also have a new event, the hit list. I'm not too sure what that is. We're gonna find out. And as always, there's always gonna be a, a Nuketown holiday skin. And every Black Ops, whatever, Nuketown drops, they do skins for each holiday. So yeah, we got that. And that's really all for season one. So I appreciate it. Like the video, subscribe, you know. I'm gonna be dropping some more videos soon and turning notifications on to see those. Let's get, let's get to it. All right.